Welcome back to my Keep Up channel. Zara McDermott and boyfriend Sam Thompson are locked in a heated chat as they depart star-studded soccer aid after party. Zara McDermott was spotted locked in a heated chat with her boyfriend Sam Thompson following the celebrity soccer aid on Sunday. The former Love Island star, 27, engaged in a fiery conversation with the maiden Chelsea star as they departed the star-studded after-party held at the Royal Garden Hotel in Kensington. As they waited for their taxi home, Zara appeared frustrated as she visibly waved her arms around while deep in a tense chat. Earlier in the day, supportive girlfriend Zara cheered on the TV star as he helped England secure a 6-3 win against World Eleven in the charity match. But hours after the boozy celebrations, the couple went head-to-head -head outside the after-party. After Zara frantically pointed at the I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here star, he began to walk away from the conversation. Mail Online have contacted Zara and Sam's representatives for a comment. Before the couple arrived at the after-party, Sam kick-started his team's celebrations on a party bus with the likes of Jill Scott, Danny Dyer, Bobby Brazier, and Tom Grennan. Zara was the epitome of chic as she cheerfully supported Sam alongside his family in the stands. Sam took to the field at Stamford Bridge in London for the UNICEF 2024 event and was supported by his doting girlfriend as England triumphed with a 6-3 victory over a star-studded World Eleven. The Love Island stunner looked effortlessly glamorous as she flaunted a classy look in a white puffed blouse and a flawless blow-dry. She accessorized with small chunky gold earrings and showed off her stunning looks in a rouge lipstick and rosy blush. Zara grinned from ear to ear as she proudly recorded bits of the game with her phone and threw her hands in the air thrilled. She added high-waist tight black denim to her look and carried the essentials in a light khaki shoulder bag with a chain, finishing with glam black shades. On Saturday, Sam revealed he has suffered an injury just hours before he was set to play for the Celebrity Soccer Aid match. The radio host revealed he had been living in the physio room in the lead-up to the game. Sharing an update to his Instagram, he uploaded a clip while he received treatment from the team. Reuniting with his former I'm a Celebrity campmate, Tony Bellew, who will play for rival Team World Eleven, the duo caught up after Sam's physiotherapy session. Walking into the room, the boxer joked, Do you just live in here? You've been in here all day. Laughing Sam responded, it's because I tweaked the old quad, mate, before adding that Tony didn't believe he was injured. They call the physio room, the Sam room. What a group of legends, the TV personality captioned. This year's Soccer Aid clash took place in London, where a mix of former pro footballers and celebrities representing two teams England and the world took on each other in a televised event at Stamford Bridge to raise money for UNICEF. Sam was joined by Stephen Bartlett, Bobby Brazier, Stuart Broad, Alex Brooker, Aaron Doherty, Danny Dyer, Sir Mo Farah, Tom Grennan, Eddie Hearn, Tom Hiddleston, Patty McGuinness, Minnie Minter, Sam Quack, who will complete the celebrity squad. Legends Jill Scott, Captain, Gary Cahill, Karen Carney, Joe Cole, Jermaine Defoe, David James, Theo Walcott, Ellen White, and Jack Wilshire competed England. Meanwhile, stars Usain Bolt, Captain, Maisie Adam, Theo Baker, Martin Comston, Diamond, Tommy Fury, Roman Kemp, Lee Mack, Jason Manford, Emmett J. Scanlon, Michael Ward, and Tyan Wayne joined Tony on World Eleven. With Eden Hazard, Roberto Carlos, Petr Cech, Patrice Evra, John Obi Mikel, Michael Eschen, Alessandro Del Piero, Kyra Hamraoui, Olga Garcia, and Kaylin Kyle also joining as legends. Soccer Aid for UNICEF was created in 2006 by Robbie Williams, with the goal of bringing nations together to help raise money and awareness for children worldwide to help them receive the best possible start to life. Soccer Aid for UNICEF was created in 2006 by Robbie Williams, with the goal of bringing nations together to help raise money and awareness for children worldwide to help them receive the best possible start to life. Last year's game, which was hosted at Old Trafford, was the the most successful game on record, raising a record-breaking £14.6 million. Source, dailymail.co.uk Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.